Hi it's Charlotte, welcome back to my channel. So for today's video, I'm going to be doing uh, what I got for my 23rd birthday. I always really like doing these just because, I don't know. I just like going through what everyone got me, like sort of remembering how grateful I am for everything and I don't know. It's just something I like to do. Obviously only watch this if you want to. Uh, I don't mean to come across braggy or anything. I'm just super grateful. So please only watch if you would like to. Yeah, let's get started. I, um... <laughs> Might first start off with what my parents got me. Let's do that. So, from my dad, my stepmom, and my little brother, um, first they got me this bright yellow mug that says Queen Bee on it. <laughs> they accidentally left the price tag on it. I love this so much. At first I saw it and I thought, like, wow, that's yellow. But actually, it's just such a fun colour, isn't it? Like, how could you not be happy whilst drinking from this mug? Do you know? So, I really, really love this. And then next up, I basically said to them that me and my boyfriend Jack were lacking in the board game area since we'd moved out and we didn't really have that many good board games. My dad and stepmom are, well, mainly my dad, are big board game people and thus I quite like board games. <laughs> so yeah, they got me quite a few. Some of them are like new to me and some are ones that they already own that I love. First off we have the noodle game. <laughs> This isn't one that they have, this isn't, this is new. <laughs> and it looks absolutely mad, but I love that it's like in the shape of like a Chinese box. I think it looks so much fun. Next up we have Munchkin. This is actually one of my favorite games that they own and I've played this quite a lot. This is a different version to the one we played Munchkin Cthulhu. I can't wait to play this one because it looks so, so cool. It looks like this on the box. This is like one of my favorite card games, so. I love it. Next up we have Battleships. I don't think I've ever played a physical game of Battleships before. I don't think so. I think I've only ever played it online. So this is quite cool and quite a nice classic game. It's quite good as well because quite a lot of these are, well no, all of them. You can play two player so me and Jack don't need more people which is kind of what I was looking for as well. We then have Elder Sign, which I wasn't, I'm really sorry by the way if my lights are glaring on them. Um, I wasn't expecting this at all. I feel like sometimes my dad just has so many ball games. I always like, I love so many of them, but I never remember what they're called. So when I opened this, I was like, which one is this again? Um, but this is one of the ones I really like to play actually. Um, it's a lot of fun. There you go, hopefully you can see it on the back there a little bit of what it's like but um this is a really really fun game last but not least they got me ticket to ride <laughs> and they have ticket to ride like america i think so they got me ticket to ride europe and i love it this is such a fun game like i said there's a lot of games that i like but this is definitely in my top ones i'm super happy to have this <laughs> right and then because it kind of ties in basically my my dad and stepmom my boyfriend jack and my friend Emma, all three parties, <laughs> um, put money towards a joint present for me. <coughs> Containing. Um, they actually got me a Prada bag, which I am absolutely in love with. I don't know whether to show you or plug that I'm gonna be doing an unboxing on my channel. You know what, no, I'll show. <laughs> in case you don't wanna see the full video that I'm doing. It is this bag here, which I'm in love with. I'm not gonna speak about it for too long because I'm gonna be doing the whole video. I love her so, so much. Best present ever. So from my friend Georgia, I got some Dairy Milk chocolate buttons, which I have yet to open, but um, I'm savoring them. And then she also got me this blue and pink Starbucks cup because, well, I literally pointed it out to her and was like, oh, look how cute that is. And she's probably just thanking the heavens. I didn't actually buy it. We both love getting a little good Starbucks together, so I love it. <laughs> and then my friend Evangeline got me some chocolate brownies, which I'm not gonna open this box because they're not in there. <laughs> they are eaten <laughs> as much as, you know what? I might be able to insert a picture. There were three different types. My favorite one was like, there was like a hazelnut one. That one was really good, um, but they are no more. There might be one or two left in the fridge. <laughs> then from my mum, my stepdad, and my little sisters, I haven't actually been able to see them yet. I've been able to see them for quite a hot minute now, but they sent me this really pretty um, Radley rose gold bracelet. Yeah, I think it's a bracelet. I think I thought it was a necklace when I got it, but um, this cute little bracelet, which is really, really pretty. We're almost at the end. <laughs> um, from my boyfriend's parents, I got given this amazing, I think it's the wrong way around. 
I don't know, maybe it's not. Um, this waffle maker. I've kind of always wanted a waffle maker. I don't think I've been always very vocal about it, but I've kind of always wanted one. And I think I mentioned it and so they got me one. So I can't wait to use this. I feel like I'm gonna have to put a whole day aside and not invite people round and give them waffles. <laughs> oh my God. They also decided to help me out with the ingredients, which I'm very grateful for because I just am. <laughs> this is like a five kilogram bag of um, complete pancake mix. I don't know if it's the same stuff that goes into the waffles. I'm assuming so. Or if not, it's just a lot of pancake mix. So I'm assuming, oh my God, this is so heavy. Yeah, so I'm assuming you can use this for waffles as well. And then, as if it couldn't get any better, they also got a, a one of these <laughs> of maple syrup, which I remember the first time I, like one of the first times I went round to my boyfriend's house when we first started dating, and they had one of these. And I just thought it was like the most amazing thing. I was like, oh my God. I was like, that's so much maple syrup. <laughs> Right, the next few bits, I am almost positive these are from my friend Kaylee. Like, I'm almost positive. In fact, this is quite embarrassing if they're not. I'm pretty sure. Like, I can't think of anyone else they can be from, but there was no note <laughs> in the parcel, and she hasn't replied to me yet. But I'm pretty sure. Um, <laughs> um, she got me quite a few bits from Urban Outfitters, which I feel like Urban Outfitters just do, like, the best home stuff. And she did me well, to be fair. First off, she got me these DIY beeswax wraps. Make your own sustainable beeswax cloth. Yeah, I don't know. They look quite cool. I don't know if it makes your food taste like beeswax. These are pretty cool. Next up, probably actually my favorite thing. I was like, oh my God, how have I not seen that? Um, it's even gonna show. There we go. Can you see it's like the middle part of a woman's body <laughs> um but i think you're meant to hang it or place it against a wall um and you can actually put like jewelry and hang necklaces and put rings on here i just think it's absolutely beautiful this is something i would like mm, i don't know if i buy it myself but it's definitely something i would look at and be like wow so i absolutely love this then have this <laughs> this little like gold like hanging ornament i'm not gonna lie i don't know where to put it I've never had something like this before where you like have to hang it, but it's absolutely beautiful. I just, yeah, I just don't know where I'm gonna put it. I'm gonna have to find somewhere. I'm sure there'll be a hook or a nook <laughs> somewhere around my house where I can hang it. If I actually, I can already see a hook on the other side of the room, which I'm thinking that might be a good place for. Lastly, I think the thing I got most excited for is this beautiful like decanter and glass set. I think it kind of looks like the kind of glass you'd put like, I don't know, whiskey. It looks like so small, <laughs> but it came like this actually. I might actually have to hold it up a little bit closer. So there we go. I think those are absolutely beautiful. I love those so, so, so much. And last but not least, I also went to claim my hotel chocolate chocolate, chocolate, <laughs> birthday gift. In fact, I was meant to get one from Space and K as well, but our Space and K is closed, so I can't actually get that at the moment. You get a five pound voucher of Hotel Chocolate, which I think is really, really good. Um, so I, of course, well, no, not of course. I just, I wanted to get like more than one thing. So I got the milk chocolate collection and then this was in the sale. So I got like the rose and violet fondants and yeah, I kind of felt like I needed a little bit more chocolate on my birthday. So that's why I got those. <laughs> so yeah, that is everything that I got for my birthday. Thank you everyone who gave me these presents and anyone who wished me a happy birthday. I had such a lovely like chilled out day. We actually went to the Gourmet Burger Kitchen for dinner and my boyfriend bought me a lovely birthday cake as well. He also made me pancakes in the morning not using the pancake mix because that wasn't opened yet. But yeah, I had a really lovely day. Spent the morning watching Love Island, <laughs> as you do. Um, but yeah, please let me know if you enjoyed this video. If you did, then please give it a big thumbs up. And don't forget to hit the subscribe button if you're new to my channel. And I'll see you in my next video. Bye.